creating an ink drop transition is really hard. Just kidding, it's not. The first thing that you need is a stock video that you can get from any stock website. In this case, I found these on Pexels.com. Now bring both of your clips into your timeline. We will deactivate the second one and put it two tracks above. We will be putting our ink video right in between. Now these are a few important things that you need to know. If your ink video has color, we're going to go to the color page and we're going to decrease the saturation. If the ink video fills the screen completely, then you can skip this step. In this case, we're going to turn this clip into a compound clip. And we're going to go into this compound clip and we're going to create a copy of this clip, rotate it and set the composition mode to multiply. Make sure to add a generator that's the same color as your ink. In this case, it's black. I fitted the ink at the bottom so that it looks like the whole screen is being covered by the ink. Now let's go back to our main timeline. Here, if your ink is black, you will set the composite mode to inverted lump. If your background is black and your ink is white, then you can use a lump. Now bring the second clip on top and set the composite mode to foreground and you're set. If you want, you can press Ctrl R and that way increase the speed of your transition. Save this video and come back tomorrow for more.